After winning the 2024 Dakar Rally, Audi receives a huge 750,000 euro fine from the FIA. But why and what happened? From the very beginning, the Audi Dakar program was a three-year project. Within three years, they wanted to win the Dakar. The first year was the learning year. The second year, they fighted for the win. And in the third year, they finally won it. So that worked as planned. But because of constant changes in Audi's management and the upcoming F1 project, it was clear that the Dakar project wouldn't be extended. Audi made very clear from the very beginning that the Dakar 2024 would be the last event for the team and the cars would go straight to the museum right after the event, if they win it or not. In December 2023, Audi enrolled for the FIA Rally Ray Championship to be able to participate in the Dakar Rally. But the championship includes five races. Dakar first, then Abu Dhabi, Portugal, Argentina and Morocco. With Audi pulling out immediately after Dakar and not participating in the following events, they violate the FIA sporting regulations to participate with at least one car in every event. And the FIA says that it's bad for the image of the series if a manufacturer pulls out like that. Although we have to say that no manufacturer, except NASA Alatia's car, was participating in every event. And also Audi traditionally only participated in Morocco in the past to prepare for the Dakar. And in the Dakar itself. So only two events. Anyway, the FIA fined Audi now with 187,500 euro for each event in which they don't participate. They missed the first race after the Dakar Rally in Abu Dhabi, so if they don't turn up for the following races, they will have to pay a fine of 750,000 euro in total. Audi appealed against this, but was unsuccessful, so they will have to pay now. For Audi this shouldn't be news, and even paying the fine would be cheaper than running their cars at these events. But after their win at the Dakar Rally this year, this leaves a bit of a bad taste. Or what do you think? Is saving money and pulling out right after Dakar the right decision? Or should they properly end the season for their last year in the championship? Or should the FIA now also find everyone else who is not participating in every event of the championship? Let me know in the comments below and see you at the next one.